Welcome to Jeremy's top 10 favorite great new things in Painter 12, the best version of this incredible painting and creative tool that we've had yet. There is so much to share. Now, to give you the big picture, when you first open Painter 12, you'll see this welcome window. And if you go to the bottom, there's a what's new in Painter 12 link. When you click it, you're going to get this document which summarizes 21 areas where there have been incredible enhancements, improvements, and new features added in this really, really amazing version of the program. For anybody who's already a Painter user, upgrade. There's not even a question about it, and you'll see why um, very soon. One of my top 10 favorite things is that they've made it so easy to get custom workspaces. So I'm one of the people who has designed a workspace for Painter 12 that's uh, shipped with the program. My workspace is called Portrait and Collage, and that's what I'm going to be using in this little uh, top 10 demonstration. Um, there are other wonderful workspaces, and to find out about them all, if you go to this link which says Get Workspaces, you will find videos by each of the people who've made their workspaces explaining what's in them and how they use them. And before we dive into talking about art and the incredible new things in Painter 12, I do want to just show you that if you ever want to get the welcome window back up again, all you need to go is to the Help, Welcome, and it'll bring it right back up. So, we're looking now at a uh, portrait that I just did in Painter 12. It's of my friend and neighbor here in uh, the artist building that I have a studio in, in San Francisco, Kathleen Maley. The arrangement of palettes may look a little crowded, that's just because I'm working at a lower resolution. Um, typically, when I'm working on a portrait like this, I work at the uh, maximum resolution of my screen, uh, 2560 times 1600. I have a lot more space to spread things around. Um, let's just zoom in a bit and have a look at some of the details of this image. And one thing you're going to notice is that I'm able to control the zoom using the navigating panel in the top right. And um, this navigation panel is a wonderful, wonderful new feature of Painter 12, which uh, I'm very excited about. It's, it's going to be up there uh, in pretty much all my workflow um, as a visual reference when I'm zoomed in. Some of you who were using earlier versions of Painter may recognize this navigator from what used to be uh, a temporary navigator that popped up when you clicked on the binocular icon in the bottom left of the canvas window. The only problem with that was it disappeared, um, so it didn't remain there. This you can keep there, and so this is definitely my uh, number two in my top 10.